hi everyone welcome to SHR classes today in this video we have to find the value of root 3 so finding the value of root 3 let's start the video first of all we have to write 3 like this way and I'm going to find the value of root 3 up to 3 decimals so we have to take 3.60 and marking the zeros as pair okay now taking the division mark now what should we put here if you put 1 then this is 1 1 0 1 if you put 2 then 2 2 0 4 which is greater than 3 so we should take here 1 so 1 1 0 1 now subtracting this so this is 2 now this point will be here okay now putting the fear of 0 okay so now taking the double of 1 so 2 double of 1 equal to 2 now roughly discussing some calculation here now what should we put beside 2 to get almost near to 200 if you put 1 then this is 21 which is less than 200 but not almost 200 if you put 2 then this is 44 which is less than 200 but not almost near 200 if you put 3 then this is 64 which is less than 200 but not almost near 200 if you put 7 then we get 189 this is almost near 200 okay so we can put here 7 and this is 189 now subtracting this so this is 1 and this is 1 now putting the pair here pair of 0 and taking the double of 17 so double of 17 equal to 34 now similar ways what should be put here beside 34 so if you put here 1 then which is 341 less than 1 1100 but which is not almost near to 1100 if you put 2 then this is 684 which is less than 1100 but not almost near to 1100 if you put 3 then this is almost near to 1100 so we can take or we can put here 3 okay so this is 1029 now subtracting this so this is 1 and this is 7 again putting the pair of zeros here similar ways taking the double of 173 so double of 173 equal to 3 to your 6 14 carry 1 and this is 3 so here will be 3 4 6 now similar ways we have to put any number and multiplying by this num by that number if you put here 1 then which is less than 7100 but not almost near to 700 7100 if you put here 2 then which is 6924 which is almost near to 7100 so we can take here 2 okay if we put here 3 then which is greater than of 7100 so we put here 2 so now subtracting this so this is 6 and this is 7 now <coughs> the calculation will be continuous but we take up to 3 decimal and therefore the value of root 
3 equal to here 1.732 and continuous so this is the process to find out the value of root 3 that's 